Yo, what is good? My anime people doesn't get tired saying that. My people. So, the new mech show. It definitely took a slow approach this week's episode with them being in the town and learning more or less how broken up their robots are to the point where they couldn't even help these civilians try to escape. And even if they did, they would have to fight both the Asian and Oceanic armies at this time. So it wouldn't have been that good of a show. <laughs> or not show. It wouldn't have been a good time for them, especially with how much damage their robots have already sustained. Putting them into more battle it has made them even more useless towards the future. So it's better to get maintenance than push it through something that it shouldn't be going through and then getting maintenance because it's just going to either A, take more time, or B, something really bad happens and it can't even be repaired. It has to just be completely switched, which will take more time. Um, that being said, though, this new robot girl who has a princess that after destroying the most amount of robots we've ever seen in one go, starts just to break down crying. <laughs> I think this might actually be a situation where the the writer is not in not in as much control as the other two are. So maybe that was the problem there. Um, yeah, there's gonna be a little beeping in the back for a little bit until someone gets that. There it goes. Um, but yeah, it definitely puts me in a position where I love to see where the show is going as of right now. But to be fair, I haven't seen much that makes it better than uh, Blood Orphans, the Iron Blood Orphans Gundam anime. So that's unfortunate, but they still have plenty of time to grow these characters, to make me like them more. And to showcase what they can do when they're in these tough situations. Because as of right now, the toughest situation they've been in is not having their robots and being attacked when they're younger. Or having their robots right now being damaged and practically being under the will of the, the enemy. And has to do what they tell you to do until you can get free. That's about it. Um... Then we see one robot absolutely destroy both sides with an ease. And if it is what I'm thinking it is where the AI was controlling the ship more than the actual pilot, I would be interested to see if her character grows into being a better pilot like the AI and pushing it just as far, if not even further. So with all that being said, overall, I love me this show. But at the same time, it's... Definitely slowing down, and that's okay for me if it has, like, more seasons. But if it's about to come to a conclusion sooner than later, I would really hope that they kick up some more stuff compared to what they've done in this week's episode. But nonetheless, I will definitely be watching and keeping up with it. So with that being said, I hope you all have an amazing day, night, evening. I am your boy, the Anime G. I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.